crazy mail day today guys so I figured with this much mail I don't even know what this one is I have no clue what that one is it's a big box it sounds like it's full of cars I've done a few break couple of breaks here paid paid breaks um, where I bought into breaks here recently so I'm thinking a couple of those, these are that but you know what? I'm just gonna since it's so much and I don't know where what exactly all of it is jump in here and I'm gonna I'll edit out me opening it, but I'll pull each one out and show you on camera. Should be exciting because I don't remember a lot of what it is. So let's go. All right. So what I did, I just went ahead and just cut all the tops off. So we'll just pull them one by one, check it out, see what's going on. Hope you guys had a great weekend watching some football, NFL kicking off. Panthers played really good. Their defense looked like a top two, three in the league. So I think a lot of this now, I was just thinking about it. I have been buying a lot of PC stuff, uh, autos and things like that of some Panthers with the season kicking off. It's got me all kind of wanting to make sure I've hoarded up on, you know, the, uh, on Panthers. So some a good deal of this might be PC stuff that I'm not selling at shows and things like that. On the other hand, there's going to be a lot of it that is from that uh, I will be either sending off the SGC or um, just selling raw at shows. So first one is here is a, uh, Jeremy Chin, um, yeah, you know I'm bad with the prism, different parallel naming of of what these are, but uh, that's a cool one. So I got a got a bunch of bunch of the prism parallels of like Ch Jeremy Chin, Brian Burns, Ye Yeter, Yeter, Gross Matos, um, you know. D uh, let's see who else. Terrence Marshall, all these kind of guys. Okay, this one, this is one I thought I had had been lost in the mail. A um, little sleeper here for you too. This guy here, Jake Funk, running back for the chart. Uh, sorry, the L.A. Rams. Uh, talking about he might get some play this year. You know, I got that super cheap, but it was incredible when I went out like putting some bids on his stuff. Some of his autos and things that would for other players be just super low end, five to twenty dollar. Although his stuff has been bidding up, he's got like a huge fan base. So, Jake Funk, uh, talented running back. All right, here we go. So it's got a little weight to it. This one might be a break here. Let's see. One of these box breaks I did. Let's see. No, okay. This is uh, pretty cool. This is a Jameis Winston lot here. Bought a lot of. Winston rookies that put <laughs> and I did before they played so uh, This one's gonna pan out check it out um, stained glass Winston I, I guess I'm gonna look these over see what they look like. This is a cool one here rookies and stars number to 99 So What a game he had you know not a lot of yardage, but very very precise with like five touchdowns so so this tops base rookie Top's finest rookie. Prism die cut rookie. I like that card. It's pretty neat. Uh, draft pick silver. No tops. Base card. <laughs> I don't know how many tops base cards he's got. This one's a prestige. Probably. You know, just. It's not prestige. It's not prestige draft picks, but this is one of his rookies, Bowman rookie. Bo is this Bowman? Maybe Bowman draft picks. I don't know. So all those I got those for so cheap, and they've already skyrocketed. So that turned into being a pretty good buy right there. Already, that, has, that one has already paid off. You win some, you lose some. You don't win all of them. All right, let's see what this is. This one. Okay, uh, I think this is gonna be good. This is from Top Line Cards at Top Line on Instagram. Bought it from them on eBay, but this is gonna be a pretty cool. I think this is gonna be decent here. And these are all numbered too. Almost all of them are numbered. Van Jefferson, uh, a lot, it's a rainbow of Jefferson. So that's the only one that's not. 
green reactive maybe is what they call it. This one's a uh, orange prism, 199, 179, blue prism, and this one's a uh, light blue maybe, or this is 299. So got those for and a lot for a pretty good deal. I'm gonna look over, like I said, most of them. And um, since I'm off the SGC right there, so check them out and check out Top Line Sports. Got a good deal on that lot right there over on eBay. All right, a lot of cards here. Sorry, it's already at five minutes. So let me keep, let me move right along here. All right, thanks for your business. Enjoy the card. Please provide positive feedback. SAB Collectibles, good packaging. All right, get into it here. Yeah, yeah, you're not getting into this thing. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah. Okay. So I'm real excited about this one. My first Steve Smith auto. Steve Smith on card with San Antonio home San. Antonio Holmes. Oh, this is a rookie. Number to 50 winning combos. Don't think this is a rookie year. 2006. Second year, maybe. Really excited about that. 100% PC right there. So, that's a beautiful card. I didn't realize either when I went out looking for, to buy a couple Steve Smith autos that his market's pretty expensive. So, uh, you know, like Marvin Harrison, I was looking. His his cards are kind of cheap in comparison to Steve Smith. I was surprised that the market was. Oh, this is a good one here. Uh, was as high as it is for Steve Smith. I do expect Steve Smith to be a first ballot Hall of Famer though, and it will. I will go to Canton to celebrate his induction. So I will vlog that for sure. That's, um, all right. So this is a good one here. So this is. Another one like the like the Jameis. Check it out, uh, Jalen Hurts, Prism Black, Silver. Um, good shape. Little off left to right. Like I said, I got to put get the microscope out or the magnifying glass out and look at these a whole lot better. But um, I'm excited about that one. He played really well and took command of the team there and led them to victory. Even though the Falcons are trash. I, what we call them around these parts is the Falcons, the Tampa Bay Suckaneers, and we call them the New Orleans Stains. Uh, that's the NFC South, and then we call the Carolina Winthers, not the Panthers. All right, so so Winston, and this one is a Crusade Prism rookie. So uh, loaded up on Jameis now. So pretty excited about that. Got about still got about four or five packages left. Like I said, this is the reason I wanted to do this mail day video because I don't think I've had a mail day this big. And a couple of these said they were delivered over the weekend. They didn't, you know, and they weren't in my mailbox. I was getting concerned. Um, oh wow, this is pretty incredible. So I don't know who I bought this from. But uh, Jeremy Chin, I think this is bronze, optic bronze, Panther, PC again. Um, but check it out. He threw in a Trevor Lawrence rookie draft class. And that was not, you know, when I bought that card, that this was not part of it. So that was a throw in. Typically people throw in kind of, you know, a few commons or some nothing you'd really want. Maybe unless it's your a PC team, which a lot of people think you PC everybody. Like when I buy a Winston or other, these other people that I'm just kind of buying those for the shows. Uh, people throw in stuff thinking I'm a uh, Saints fan or Bucks fan or whatever. Um, okay, now this one I did go out and buy because I opened a and I was gonna make a video on it. I just didn't feel like it was video worthy. I opened because it it's only four packs and I didn't have any real big hits. I, bought, I opened up a 2021 Illuminance hobby box didn't really hit anything out that was um anything to write home about uh so but i, I just loved the, the look of it so i went out and i 
bought this off of Facebook Marketplace. Trevor Lawrence Luminance. This is Hobby version number two ninety nine. Uh, paid paid up probably a little bit more than I'd want to on this, so it's probably be one I'll sit on for a little while to see. I think it's still gonna be good. Uh, you know, he had a he had a rough first game. And it over the, the overreaction first week one crowds out in full effect. You know, just to be expected. People just expect people expect uh, the miraculous, you know, and, and judge people on one game nowadays. This is the first full game for all these rookies and really for the, all these teams to, to play all together, especially rookie quarterbacks. I mean, come on, man. Look at, look at uh, Peyton Manning. I mean, um, look at Peyton Manning. Took him a couple years to get it to get it together. Most quarterbacks do take a couple years to actually hit their peak and stride. All right, another Jeremy Chin orange here. This is not oh, it is number two forty nine on the back. You can see right in the middle of his chest there. Uh, so pretty insane. Last uh, single card, and then this other one I don't know what it is. It's got to be his box break. Uh, so we'll see what that is in a second here. Okay, this is another uh, pretty uh, a card that I'm very much excited about. Jalen Hurts die cut. Um, this was number two, three fifty five. See at the bottom. Cannot get it to focus at all. Anyway, it's number twenty three out of um, three fifty five. So really cool card right there. Select, even though, uh, like I said, I'm not, I'm not as big on select. Select's gonna be a garbage. Um, it's gonna be garbage going forward because, uh, because of the retail, you know, configurations and overproducing of them, and, and people love select and prism. But you know what, man, those are gonna be the new junk wax, unfortunately, because they're just getting overprinted, and um, there's no stopping them in the foreseeable future. All right, I'm opening up this big old box here. Oh, 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 I do remember this. Okay, so I bought this from a guy. Um, I'm probably not going to show it all. I'll just hold it up and show you. Just an insane rookie card lot of hoops, hoops premium, and some Don Russ. Uh, rookies, all rookies, a huge rookie lot. I bought one lot from them, and then we started communicating in the chat um, about the uh, about the rest of his cards that he, he he's trying to get rid of. Just he's just wanting to dump them. He said, you know. So um, I'll probably just show you the highlights of it. But I mean, it's stacks. I think it wind up might be like 150, 200 rookies. Uh, I mean, you know, so this is hoops, premium stock, and colors, all this other stuff. Got this dirt cheap. I think I, I wind up. I told them I bought the first lot. I'll show you. The, here's the first lot. So, um, James Ramsey, Tyrell Terry, R.J. Barrett, this hoops premium, R.J. Barrett. Hoops Premium, Tribute, Zion, Hoops Premium, Tyler Hero, Blue Wave, Lamelo, Class of 2020 Hoops, Amp, was it like five Anthony Edwards? So I bought those for maybe 50, 60 bucks for that lot, okay? So I kind of just paid a little under market on those. But then he started to talk, tell me about the rest and, uh, think it wind up being for the whole lot like 120 bucks I mean and a lot of them aren't like big names uh, but it could be it's, it's NBA you know so I mean there's like Pocacheski you know there's what I mean is that there's five Pocacheskis you know what I mean and so a lot of these guys could be breakouts Keldon Johnson reactive or whatever that is uh, there's some silvers in there you know what I mean Quite a few Bobo reactive, um, you know. So a, a lot here for sure that I'm going to kind of sit on to the season. 
might, might sell a couple of them, you know, like a couple of Ant, Ant-Man's got five of them. So, uh, I just thought it was a good deal. Um, and you know, I, I could relate to the guy. I want to just get rid of him, but you know, I set up at shows and stuff. So th- that kind of a lot makes sense for me. And, um, anyway, guys, I don't want to go too long here. Um, you know, like I said, you know, my real big highlights here are these Panther PC cards. So Jeremy Chin, uh, yeah, J- Jeremy Chin heavy, those three chins, including the optic bronze auto. And then this huge, uh, Steve Smith on card, which is, is really cool for me. So there it is, guys. I just wanted to, to share that. I figured it was, since it was such a big mail day and I hadn't made a video in about a week. So, um, good stuff. Uh, I think two weeks I'm going to Virginia Beach show. I'll be vlogging that. And then the week after going to Nashville to the Music City, uh, Music City Collectibles or whatever it is, uh, an autograph show. And that was huge. That's going to be a huge show. Santiago Sports, I think, is sponsoring it bunch of people signed a Pete Rose, Ricky Henderson, Hulk Hogan, um, bunch of Hall of Famers, Johnny Bench. Uh, so look into coming to that one if you're in on the East Coast or just want to come to a show, big show. Like I think PS, PSA DNA certification is going to be there. I'm going to get authenticated. Some of those, uh, that autograph lot I bought the other day, which I didn't uh, create a video on, but I, I bought a big, huge lot of uh, autograph cards. Some of them were hand signed at shows and things, never authenticated. So, um, stay tuned for that because I got some big ones Jerry West, Auto, um, Mike Ditka, something like that. So, excited to get those authenticated. And I'll get those authenticated at that Music City show in Nashville. So, uh, if you guys are enjoying the content and stuck, you stuck around here to the end, do me a favor, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on the bell to get notified when new videos come out. That's all I got. Till next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Doses.